Well, the little boy and, and his, his, his buddy who lived next door, um, he had a boat. And the little boy next door always helped him. That was you. Yeah, this little, is a real story. And the little boy was me. <laughs> and, the, and my neighbor was named Ricky. And he used to um, come down with me and help me with the boat. That. I, I didn't tell you his name. Mm -mm. So <clears throat> we were going to go down and we're, we were going to row down the creek and maybe do a little fishing. So we we had a homemade trailer and we took the, the boat around the corner and, and the creek wasn't too far away. And it was, had to go across a little bridge on the road and then down a dirt path and we put the boat in the water. And we had gotten the oars out and we paddled up the creek and then we paddled down the creek and we decided it was kind of hot so we were, we were going to sit underneath the road in the tunnel which was a little tunnel it was about from one side of the house to the other it went underneath the roadway and uh, we went underneath the road and we're sitting there and it was all nice and dark and cool and we're cooling off and we thought we heard voices we looked at each other did you, did you hear that his voices. So we paddled a little bit to get closer to that side of the of the bridge, and sure enough, it was a, a boy and girl. And we kind of stuck our heads out and looked up, and they're dang they're sitting on top of the of the edge of the bridge, with their legs dangling over, and uh, they were holding hands. <laughs> and we're kind of we're kind of snickering, and uh, <clears throat> they were talking and talking. And pretty soon, the boy leaned over and gave the girl a kiss on the cheek and we we started singing kissy face smacky lips kissy face smacky lips <laughs> and that boy didn't like it <laughs> he was mad and so he came down to the edge of the, the water and we rode going the other way and he ran across the road to the other side we rode back the other way <laughs> <laughs> he kept we kept going back and forth. He started throwing some rocks at us and stuff, and so uh, eventually, um, when he went to one side, we rode really fast and we rode down down the creek um, pretty far. We thought we had we had gotten away from him. Pulled the boat up on the bank, and uh, we're gonna we're gonna head head home. And uh, then we saw him. He was he was in the woods coming down the path. So we knew the woods really well. And we knew all the little paths and all the little um, places that we used to fish and, and hide and stuff and, and play games. So he kept, he saw us and he started running. And we went around through a bunch of trees and we, we knew right by the edge of the water that there was a little embankment where you could kind of jump off right through the water and the bank kind of over overhung like this. Here was the water. We jumped over here and we hid side by side underneath the bank and he ran right past us and you could hear his foot, footsteps go, tuk, 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 tuk. and so we were hiding there wondering if he was going to come back pretty soon he wandered back and he came closer and closer to us and he kept yelling i'm gonna find you guys and when i do you're gonna get it and so we were pretty scared and We we're laying there, and out of the embankment comes a worm, and the worm was touching my my friend's shoulder. Oh, he no. in his sleeve, and it went here. <laughs> he says, "What's that?" What? Shh, it's only a worm. And then, oh, a worm. <laughs> so that means it's not a snake. <gasps> We got really close. I'm gonna find you. You can't hide from me. And so we just stayed there really still. And he, st and he stood there still for so long, we thought maybe he had gone. So I peeked out, peeked out over the over the embankment, and there is the back of his pants were right there. We hid back in there again. And he finally gave up and started walking away. And you could hear him. We peek out a little bit and saw him going. 
And uh, we waited a long time after we couldn't see him anymore because we, we thought he was probably hiding behind a tree waiting for us to come out. When we did, we didn't see him again. We went and got our boat, took it underneath the bridge, and got it on the trailer, 